Hi everyone, this is Vicki. I went to the thrift store by my daughter's house again, so I bought a few things. I thought I'd share with you those things, and also I went to um, the vintage market this morning, so and I found some nice things, so I'll share with you those things as well. So, at the, at the thrift store, I found this, and um, and I guess there is, what does it say? 12 cutouts of a gingerbread boy. And then they, there's this um, stamp by Printworks. So I got it for $2. And so I thought that was cute. I got some um, candy canes. So these were a dollar. Each, I just got two of them, and then I found these. They are a uh, silk ribbon, so there's green and there's pink or peachy color, so that's nice. Four yards, and then I got this ribbon for 50 cents. It's a brown, checkered, thicker ribbon, and I found this ribbon which I love. This is very similar to the one that um, that Judy gave me that's white and I cut it in half and then put it around the uh, the heart uh, cut out. It came out really cute. Like a little ruffle around a heart. Um, I'm not sure what I'll do with this but I, I loved it and I only found this amount. <laughs> And then I got this uh, embroidery hoop for 50 cents at the thrift store. And also this for $3 as this is a Stampin' Up. Um, I think this is fairly new, it's a 2000 something. Um, and that cart is so super cute. And that angel, if you see that angel is really cute too. So that has purple stamps there. So that's what I got at the um, thrift store. And then um, I went to the vintage market this morning. Let's see, I can't show you these right now, but I don't want to forget, so I'll put it on top of here. Okay, so let me just show you um, the laces I got first from the vintage market and let's see I did get this large one this um these laces they're I mean there's tiny laces on a card on this plastic card I've gotten these kind before in um, downtown LA um, and they put them on on these this kind of plastic thing so I think someone got that and then just added their little laces that they had but these are really pretty tiny laces I wouldn't call them um, antique but they are so pretty oh there's another one here wow this one's nice too this little one here so I do have some of these that look familiar, but not all of them. So I got those. Those are so pretty. And then I got a, a bunch of little remnants. So there's ones like this. And this one is really beautiful. That's pretty vintage. This one little remnant pieces I think from different sellers so look how dainty that is and um, I got this pink a lot of that pink and some vintage ones and this is elastic I think and then um, oh I love this one this one looks pretty close to antique. I like that. And I haven't seen this one before. It's very pretty. 
This pink one is really pretty too. Very dainty. There's a little tiny remnant of uh, this purple lace. It's very beautiful. So there was some tulle in that basket of um, different laces. This is kind of vintage. And there's a lot in there. And then this one looks pretty almost antique looking. And this one. So there's quite a bit here. <laughs> this one. And this is beautiful. I love that one. It must have been on something because it looks like it's taken apart. And I got some handkerchiefs, which are really cute. I like this um, embroidery, embroidered one. And this one's beautiful. Love this pink. This one's in really good condition. This one. And this, what did she say? This was her mother's, she said. Very pretty. And this one. I love this one. And some more eyelet. I did want to get some old eyelet. And I showed you that one. Okay, so only last thing I got is, is linen. Um, and probably a tablecloth, a little tablecloth. But I thought this would be great to um, cut apart or stamp or um, use for different things. It's always nice to have some linen. So those are the um, laces that I got and handkerchiefs. And I haven't been able to go, so it's, um, I'm so glad I was able to go to this time. And I did find some good stuff, so I'm very happy with today. Getting out early and, and, um, finding some goodbyes. So that was the lace. And then I did pick up this, um, these books which I cannot believe I found these. The lady <clears throat> had about six of these books and it says May 1911, which she said, um, she just said, go ahead, open it up and look at it. And it's, it's starting to fall apart. But the, I thought these were great for journals and things. I'm not sure if I really want to tear it apart. But um, there's a lot of um, advertisement kinds of things in here. And um, and she just sold them for a dollar a piece. And I didn't want to buy all of them because they do have different pictures. In it, and they are very pretty. You can see the pictures that are in there. And... Um, I, you know, I just couldn't see myself tearing these apart, but maybe photographing them and, and tearing that apart. <laughs> I'm not sure, but, um, they're all, they're just so beautiful that I just picked up two of them. And, um, and this has, and even the advertisements that are in there are really cool. So I got that one and I got this one and has, you know, different stuff in there. I don't know if you want to guys want to see that or not, but I just bought two and then I got this one and this was a dollar also, but this is 1944 and it's a calendar. I guess this says about five cents up here. Amazing. And it has a lot of, um, war stuff on it. Um, this is California. 
North Hollywood, the physical therapy. And then there's a lot of um, advertisements. And this says headline Eisenhower, post war. And there's pictures like Norman Rock Rockwell's type of pictures in here. And I just thought that's pretty cool. I love old things. See, that's like Norman Rockwell photographs. And then the old old articles here in black and white. So I picked this up. I haven't really looked at it, but it's so cool. So I bought those. And the last thing I got at the uh, vintage market are these things. Actually, this was the first thing I picked up. <laughs> I asked her how, how she was selling these, by the piece or what, and she said, it depends if you want the whole thing, I have a price for that, and if each if you just buy one, it's a dollar, a dollar each for the spool, so I just bought the whole thing. <laughs> so, so I have lots of old thread, and as I have bought some in the past, and they work very well, and um, this is fun. I love these. They're all wooden spools. I guess she decided not to collect them anymore. But they have, you know, they're... I just think that's so cool. I love these. So I bought the whole thing. Anyway, <laughs> what I'm going to do with it, I don't know, but I'm going to use the thread. So that's what I got uh, to the thrift store and to the vintage market. And then... I will be back with another video of some new stuff I bought. So I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.